What's up everybody, it's that white boy from the FromTheArtNation.com Back at it again with another video And today we are talking about MK677 Which is a human growth hormone secretagogue The studies, the dosages to build muscle, to lose fat Do you need a PCT? And my personal favorite uh, to stack it with Now as a disclaimer, I'm not a doctor Learn of any form of medical degrees whatsoever I don't pretend to be a doctor Don't listen to what I say, this is all my personal opinion How I say things, always go to a doctor before using any form of supplementation So MK677 is a HGH secretagogue which is a human growth hormone secretagogue. A secretagogue is something which the substances causes another substance to be secreted, you know, so it triggers your own body into making more growth hormone on its own, which is in my opinion better than um, overlapping with actual growth hormone. Combat muscle wasting disease and obesity. Technically, MK677 is not a SARM, okay? There's kind of a misunderstanding on this topic because it's not hormonal. Okay, so it doesn't affect natural testosterone production. So which also means you won't need a PCT, which is a post-cycle therapy after the usage of MK677. Technically, you could also use it in a PCT or even as a bridge in between. So studies were done at healthy human males. They were given 25 milligrams and after seven days, they, they seen a drastically increase in the IGF-1 levels. IGF-1 is an insulin-like growth factor and an increase in growth hormone, of course. So the trials for obesity in MK677 showed an increase in lean muscle mass. They were given uh, MK677 for eight weeks at around 25 milligrams as well. And it showed an increase in basal metabolic rates, an increase in lean muscle mass, and again, an increase in IGF-1 and growth hormone. Now, MK677 also increases bone mineral density. It improves sleep quality like hell, if you ask me. You get tired like a baby. It's It really triggers growth hormone, trust me guys. It increases the nitrogen retention and actually improves the overall sense of well-being so now what would be the perfect dosages in my opinion the dosages to build muscle is 30 milligrams and you would split it up like uh, 10 milligrams in the morning 10 milligrams pre-workout and 10 milligrams before bed so for some people the sweet spot is 25 milligrams but most capsules come in 10 milligrams each capsule so that would be 30 milligrams now if you would use mk677 for fat burning properties I would take them first thing in the morning around 20 milligrams uh, for fat oxidation you know and if you want to use MK677 for healing properties I should take 20 milligrams once per day before bed okay now what would be the side effects coming from MK677 side effects I got which is probably a well-known side effect water retention it's not drastically that much water retention but there is personally I had some joint pain I didn't know if it was because of the MK because it was supposed to heal injuries but while I was running MK677 twice I had the joint pain so for some reason that was a side effect for me you also can get an insulin sensitivity crash which is kind of dangerous actually if you're not taking insulin pills which is insulin mimetic get lethargic and shit and you could you could take a spoon of honey before going to bed or or with the mk or something like that that's an option but you always got to be aware of the insulin okay increased hunger of course which is a side effect for me i mean i try to eat a lot but now i need to eat a lot more and i'm hungry all the time i'm sleepy all the time you know it's it's not the most convenient way of life okay now can it replace human growth hormone maybe it can for 90 percent of the people but not for all of them okay maybe for hardcore bodybuilders they need the real growth hormone and insulin but for nine percent out there and just for overall health and just 90 percent then yeah the mk677 my personal favorite is to stack with LGD4033. It gets you really full, really nice pumps, you know. You will gain weight, you will sleep good, you will eat good. You know, LGD is good for bulking, so it's a really good combination. And maybe add in some YK11. Then you got a great cycle for bulking, okay? That was it for today's video. Thanks a whole lot for watching again. Don't forget to subscribe. Go out to my Instagram, drop a follow there as well. Check out Anabolic TV. Don't forget the sources, of course, because you can save yourself a lot of money with my discounts go to from the yard nation.com order yourself some coaching programs we got enhanced coaching programs coming soon and a whole lot of cool shit so that was it for today's video like i said thanks a whole lot for watching again i'm out